tell you, I'm on my way to Costco. I got like 45 minutes to get there because I'm going to buy one of those reefs. Yeah. And the berries on right, it. Right, right. My wife said don't come home without it. The one with the smelly pine cones? Yes. And yeah, my wife flat, loves those. Yeah, and I got a flat tire. Oh, And I just no. got off the phone with AAA, and they said it's going to be three hours before they can get here. I'm going to miss Costco. You got a, you got a spare? Be, I do, but I've changed it before. And uh, it takes way more than 45 minutes to get, you know, I got like 42 minutes. Got you, got you. Okay. Yeah. Well, do you have an Igo Air? I don't. What's an Igo Air? It, well, it, it utilizes the exhaust from your car that has a combustible engine, right? Does your car have a combustible engine? Yes, it does. I put gas in it all the time. It burns a lot of gas. Okay. Well, we're going to take the exhaust right out of your exhaust pipe, yep. and we're going to use that to inflate your tire in just awesome. a couple minutes here. Where do we get one? Well, you know, I got one. Oh, hey, I got your back. That's even bro. better. I okay. got your back. That is one flat tire. Yes, it is. I know. It's it just went. Pss. It was a slow leak, I think, but I just wore it down to nothing. Let's check the pressure there. Go ahead and put those on. Okay. Right put on some gloves. Okay. And let's check the pressure in this tire. It is as L zero. It looks like it's dead. Flat in a pancake. Okay. So what yeah. you're gonna do is you are gonna take this. And you're going to put it in your tailpipe and just go ahead and start tightening that up. And okay. it is going to tighten up around. And when you feel it get good and snug, okay. that's when we're going to start your car up. Okay? okay. I, I think I understand the concept. Good. So the this first thing that simple. you want to do is just go ahead and put this right there on your tire. Okay. We'll do that. Just reel the hose out a little here. Looks like it'll get all the way around the car, too. It'll get all the way to this the front. This is awesome. Yeah. Wow. It and works. it's bright. You're not going to forget it. No. No, and you should have one sitting there right next to your jumper. Oh, so table. this is a quick clip. You just a quick clip. Just put yeah, it on just there. Clip it right on the valve, the stem. Yep. Clip it just on like there. Just like so. There you go. Um, and what you're going to do. It's like that. That's yeah. easy. So go ahead and get that in your tailpipe. Okay. I can and, do that. Uh, yep. Yeah. Tighten I'm that down to like up. 40 minutes here. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah. We're going to get you. We're I can tighten it up a little bit more. How tight do we got to get it? Okay, so you just now give it, just snug, pull it and it, make sure that it's oh, snug. Oh, it's tight. Can you get it out of there? No. Okay, yeah. now all we're going to do is we are just going to go ahead and start your car and let it idle. Okay. Okay? So, so at so idle, it's going to fill the tire. At idle, it's going to fill the tires. Oh, I hear the air. Yeah. Wow. I, yeah. It's amazing. Yeah, so you might want to stand back from there just in case it pops out of there. It's okay to leave it there. And, and you can see right here. See your tire filling up? I do. So there we go. And I can feel the compressed air here off the bleed off. So you have a, yeah, that's a bleed off and there's some air coming out of there just in case. Uh, it, it, it's just to prevent your O2 sensor from turning your car off. Oh wow. Yeah. So there, you see how your tire is oh, filling yeah. up? I see I get an air. You're getting air. That's awesome. So there we go. Wow. Okay. Hey, that's enough for me to get there. That's enough. Should we go a little bit more though? Yeah, let, just let it keep going here. Look at that. Wow, this is crazy. Yeah. So now you've got compressed air anyway. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and take this off and turn your car off. Okay. Looks like we got plenty of air. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you look at that, I got plenty of air to get. Look at the air coming out of here. That's coming just out. amazing. It is. Wow. Wow, you yeah. just feel the compression there. Yeah, so we're gonna let we're gonna let this go ahead and we're gonna let it bleed off until it's done pushing air through okay. here. Okay. Because it's all compressed air in your exhaust. Looks like my tires holding fine. I, I I knew it was a slow leak. I just kind of let it go and I shouldn't have. Yeah. So yeah. what we just did is we're letting the exhaust system let all the air out because it's yeah. compressed air in there. And now we're gonna go ahead and test to see how much pressure that uh, we got in here. Okay. Awesome. Wow. It's like 18 pounds. We got about we got about 18 pounds. About that's 17 plenty. pounds. We Which, caught it. We probably could have went more, but we I could, think that's we, plenty to get me. We could have gone more. Yeah. We could have gone more. That's so plenty. That'll get you down there to the shop. Awesome. Hey man. Okay. I gotta get going. I got like uh, 30, hey, 38 minutes left. And since you're I'm going, gonna make it. Since you're going to Costco, yeah. you can have them find out where the hole is in your tire and they can go ahead and return. Oh, they can fix it. There. Hey, where do I buy one of these? Uh, as a matter of fact, you know you're going there for the Reese and berries? Right. They sell these at Costco in the automotive section. Okay, so I'll look around. For the I here. will look around. This is phenomenal. What, All a, right. what a great tool. Yeah, hey, I hey, got Hey, thanks, back, man. Bro. I got to get going. Yeah. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Yeah.